Do you want to see your stats, items, and fame bonuses from all your accounts in one place, but too lazy to read? Well, this is a tutorial for you. Hey guys, TechMac here, and welcome back to another tutorial. And today I'm going to show all you noobs and scrubs out there how to get Mule Dump working, how to use Mule Dump, and what you can do with Mule Dump. So, let's get right into it here. This is the download page. This will be in the description down below. Just click the link and it will take you here. Just going to click this little button right here in the bottom right hand corner. And that will download all of Mule Dump as a zip file. Now to open this you're going to need a program like WinRAR which is free for 30 days. And then it just comes up with this error message or this notification here that says please purchase WinRAR. But you never do. Um, so yeah, it's basically a infinite free, free trial. And then right here, you just open it up and it will come up with this one file right here, which you can extract to your desktop just by dragging it like that. And then you can close out of all this. Uh, you don't need that anymore. And then open this folder right here. This is where all the magic happens. Now to come up with a bunch of stuff. Now, you're only going to need to worry about this and this. This is to start Mule Dump. It's like the, the .exe file. And uh, this is the, uh, the, the one that you edit and put your email and password and stuff into. But first off, what you're going to need to do is rename this file right here. This is where some people slip up because they don't rename it. You're going to need to rename it just accounts. Not accounts.js. It doesn't need that. Just accounts. Okay, because it's already a JS file, JavaScript, or JScript, or whatever the fuck it is. I don't even know. Um, and then you just uh, you open this. You can edit it uh, by clicking that right there, or you can edit it with Notepad++ or whatever. Whatever uh, Notepad editing thingamajig you have on your computer. It's easy to just go edit, and it opens with Notepad. Now, in here, it'll come up with a bunch of stuff. Only things you need to worry about is these two things right here. This is where you put in your emails and passwords for your accounts. So this is completely secure. There's nothing to worry about. I've done it with all my accounts. It's real simple. Just put your email in here. So let's take, for example, sweck at sweck.com. Or the email and then the password. I don't know. What the hell do you guys use? One, two, three, lick me. As your password and you need to keep these little quotation marks here that is key and the comma and the little colon thing right here okay and this one is in case you have mules or something you can enter the password and email for those accounts right there but if you don't just delete that line entirely and then you're going to need to close out of that and make sure to save and then you will open up this file right here has a little picture of a Chrome thingamajig because that's my browsing um, software. Um, but I'm not going to open that one because I already have one set up right here. Because uh, the other one wouldn't work because of fake email and password. But I open up this one. It has to be opened with Chrome or Firefox or a new uh, internet browser because Internet Explorer won't work. Don't use Internet Explorer anyway because it's terrible and you can be hacked. Uh, as of right now. But anyway, just open up this and it will bring up Mule Dump right here. And Mule Dump is amazing. It shows you all your items on all your mules and everything. I'm pretty scrubby. You can see I don't have lots of stuff and tops and things, but I got my, my unnamed HP potions right here or whatever they're called. I don't even know. I think they're like health, Potion of Health 2 and Potion of Health 6. I. I can't even remember. But yeah, they're pretty cool. And I've got all my my unbound rings and stuff. Uh, another thing that's pretty cool is it shows you all your stats, just like Realm I does. I have it set to stats left to max right now, but you can change that up in options right here. Just uh just click on where is it? This one right here. You can change it to base, distance from average, or left to max. So just from average. This shows you how good of a roll you got. So, as you can see, I got an okay roll on my rogue right there. I got minus 8 MP, which is kind of crappy, but it's fine. 
and yeah you can change it to base which is usually what I keep it on just because I don't really need it um yeah it shows you all the inventories of all your characters and stuff and things and my favorite part right here is the fame bonuses so it'll show you um, how many dungeons you need to complete Tunnel Rat, how many you need to get uh, Cartographer, Explorer, Sniper, all that. Pretty simple, self-explanatory. How many shots you've fired, how many cubes you've killed, um, all sorts of things. So, yeah, pretty amazing. There's a lot of different things you can do with it too. You can turn on, uh, what is it? Turn on MP and HP potions, so that'll show how many you have on your characters. I don't know why you'd even need that. It's not loading here for some reason. But, yeah, that's, that's there if you want it. Uh, you may have to click reload to reload things and stuff. There we go. It's not even working. I don't even know. But, <laughs> just keep in mind, this won't work with a Steam account. I don't know if I said that before. I've done this video so many times now. I've kept trying to record it I just keep failing but it won't work with a Steam account because you don't have a username I mean an email and password for that account unless you contact Kabam support on the Rebel Mad God uh, title screen you can contact them ask for your email and password they will have to verify your identity by asking you for your most recent gold purchases but once you set that in you can play in browser and stuff so it's pretty cool how I got my account to work. Um, Congregate's a bit different. Um, if you play on Congregate, it's it's on the it's on the website that I showed you before. It shows you all how to do it. It's pretty easy. Also, another thing that I forgot to mention was that if you scroll down all the way, you can find your vault right here. Now, this will be laid out in the exact same way that it would be if you were playing Realm. It has all your chests in order. See, I don't have too many here because I'm a scrub. It will also have your gift chests up here. Uh, I only have one filled right now, so it only shows that one. Uh, but yeah, that is Mule Dump in a nutshell. So, if you guys enjoyed this tutorial, leave a like. If you didn't, tell me why. And if you want more tutorials, just leave me a suggestion down below. Okay, finally... I finished that. You guys don't know how long it took me to do that. I've I've been doing this for about an hour now. I've tried like 10 times to record that. But my mic kept failing on me. So, yeah. See you guys later.